Hi guys, the Frugal Gal here. On one of my last videos, I had asked you guys what did you want to see for my sales video, and the majority wanted to see brooches. So that's what we're doing today. Some brooches. The numbers to remember are there's some going to be some for three dollars and some for five dollars. So this is the pile of the five dollars. Most of these are signed. These are the three dollars, and I think the majority of these are not signed. Let's go over these first. This is how it works. I accept PayPal only as a form of payment. Shipping is actual shipping. Usually if you order a few, you could get up to so many ounces if you know I ship first class for around $3 or $3.50. So what you need to do is if you find if you want to buy any of these, leave me a comment down below. Please be specific in the ones that you want. And then um, we will communicate um, via email. All right, guys, let's start with some of these $3 ones. If you remember, this came out of the jewelry box on the videos. So let's focus over here on the $3 ones. And I don't know what you would call this. It kind of reminds me of like a sea urchin, but it's really um, sharp, pointy, gold tone. All these are functioning. The back works perfectly fine in excellent shape. So $3 on that one. We have this one. It's a clown holding some balloons, as you can see. Uh, the balloons are painted, kind of have like gold running through them, like a speckledy look to them. It's got a red nose. Looks like one of those hobo clowns. Works great. Gold tone, not sign. This is three dollars. You remember three balloons, three dollars. Uh, we have this one. It's a flower brooch. That's enamel, blues, greens, purples on that one. Gold tone on the back. Like I said, working back just fine. $3. This is actually signed, but I put it over and they signed um, 2770. I did look that up. I can't remember the company information, so you could look it up. It's very pretty, and just to look at it, you wouldn't notice that there's anything missing. But there are some rhinestones up here. There's four missing there, and it is missing the one for its eyes, so that's why I have it over in the $3. But $3 for that beautiful peacock brooch. Back works just fine, just missing a few rhinestones. If you wore that, I don't even think you would notice that those were missing. Really pretty blues and greens and a little bit of purple in there. Three dollars. I'm gonna sell these as a pair. Very sparkly, newer. I think somebody might have made these. They work. Very sparkly rhinestones. You get both these for three dollars. So if you want these, please tell me the circular rhinestone so I'll know. These are together for three dollars. This one is a silver tone. Has rather large rhinestones in it silver tone leaf wreath say that 10 times fast wreath leaf leaf wreath and it is got the brooch thing on it it almost looks like it would be a scarf thing too because of that but that's how it's set on there so it's got the brooch back that would be three dollars very pretty oh you can see how those sparkle oh they're not actually one whole one there's like one two three four in there sorry looking through the camera it looked different not missing any stones. Very pretty. And we have this one. Gold tone, some scroll work on that up here. That heart is ceramic. Pink heart, I mean, not heart, the flower inside the heart is a pink ceramic flower. And then filigree. And then scroll on the back. All working, functioning. Very pretty. $3. This one. It's a flower brooch. What I find interesting about this, if you turn it this way, it's got rhinestones inside the flower. And that end also it has two right there. It's a purple and silver tone, kind of grayish. No mark on the back. Works great. $3. I hope I'm not going too fast, but I don't want to make a really huge long video. These I'm going to sell together. This is a souvenir pen from Durenberg. And this, somebody told me this is over in Europe, a um, ski resort. Durenberg Ski Resort. And it's like one of those little things you write up in. And it's old, so it's kind of in rough shape. But very neat. And I'm going to put it with this little pen. 
I know that's supposed to be a wagon, one of those rickshaw, rickshaw, is that what you call it? Where the person's in front and they're, you're riding in the back and they're like bicycling you? Or if it's a little carriage, I can't really tell. But anyway, these together, $3. Okay, we have a little frog one. Gold tone, silver tone, bumpy back, two little green stone for eyes. Kind of tiny. That will be $3. Kind of reminds you of one of those scatter pins, doesn't it? Mm, let's put this one with the Avon one. This is Avon. It's ceramic. It is marked Avon on the back. You can see right there. The pin marks. Put this with this blue stone. I don't know if that's a real stone or if it's simulated. Gold, um, silver tone, I'm sorry. We'll do these for uh, $3 together. So you get both these for $3. And then why we will just put these together for $3 together. The gold tone leaf and a um, circular brooch. So there you go. There's a lot of brooches there for the $3 lot. Let's go over now and work on the $5 lot. This wonderful carnival mask. She's got a little diamond chipped right there. Of course, faux diamond, of course. And then rhinestones here. But it looks like a little diamond like somebody put on their face. A carnival mask or theater mask. And then she's got a little hoop in the ear. I thought that was neat. Gold tone, $5 for that, not marked. This is an is marked, is marked AK on the back and it's, that stands for Anne Klein. It is um, a heart with this crisscross gold tone. It is a blue color, a very dark blue. If you look at it from far away, it almost looks black, but it's blue. And hollow on this side and, it, and it's in great shape. That would be $5. This is a wonderful metal brooch and with um, enamel over it. You can see that close up. This is a signed Trifari piece. And it is signed right there. I'll let you guys see it close up. It's actually a crown Trifari, if you can see that. Crown Trifari with the C after the copyright symbol. That was $5. Some good stuff here. This is a beautiful leaf, gold tone. It is signed, it is a Jerry's, signed Jerry's piece. It's very hard to pick up on here. I'm not gonna be able to get it to pick up, but it is signed Jerry's, that's $5. We have this one and it is signed and it says one of those ones that says um, 120th 12 karat gold filled. It's signed right there. We can try to get it to pick up on here, but I don't know if we're going to be able to. And if you want any more information on any of these, just ask me below down in the comments. This is a beautiful dragonfly. It is not signed, but I just think it's so pretty that it deserves to be $5. The rhinestones there, there, and the little beads or rhinestones, rhinestones for there. And this looks like Mother of Pearl. And that'd be $5. This is a Sarah Coventry. G. Anybody's name start with G. And it is signed Sarah Coventry. Let's turn it over. See if I can get that to pick up. Sarah Coventry. I don't know how it's. Yeah, it's Sarah Coventry. Silver tone. Okay, I'm going to have to go real quick and download this, and then I'll be right back and we'll continue with these $5 ones. All right, guys, we are back again, back again. I noticed when I was downloading that other video and watching it, you know, the first part of this one, actually, that I was saying lots a lot. Now, I don't want you to misunderstand. When I give the prices, this is individually. So these over here are $5 each. Over here are $3 each. When I say lot, I know I know I buy lots, and there's usually one price for the whole lot. But I just don't want somebody to say, but you say lots, and no, no, no. Don't argue with me. Okay. Okay. So let's get back to the $5 brooches. We've done all these. We have these. Um, this will not pick up on here, but I looked at it beforehand and I knew it anyway. But I know it's not, it's so tiny printed on there. This is a side Monet. And what does Monet mean? Say it with me now. Monet means Monet. Well, you're gonna get this Monet. Pretty 
circular brooch for five dollars with the faux pearls now i say faux pearls they might be real i don't know but i do know one thing i can get this focused in better there you go five dollars i've read up on these and these circular brooches were popular in the 50s now i don't know if this is from the 50s um here is another one actually you know what this one is not signed and it's circular with another faux pearl, which might be a real one, I don't know. I meant to put this over on the $3, but I'll tell you what. You're going to get a deal today. You're going to get both these. The Monet and then this one. Gold tone for $5. So, look, you saved $1.50 because this was going to be 3 See, so making making all kinds of deals. So, $5, you can get both these. Just say two circular gold tone brooches with the faux pearls. $5. This is really pretty a leaf. I love leaves. I don't know why. I just love leaves. I like trees. Uh, faux pearl in the middle. This is signed. It is Sarah Coventry. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pick it up because the signature is like, oop, I'm flipping you off again. Uh, is right underneath there. But trust me, it is Sarah Coventry. And I don't think I'm going to be able to pick it up. I know you can't see there. Oh, it's this way. Maybe I can if I get just right. Can you see? Maybe we'll be able to see. But it is Sarah Coventry. Very pretty. Very small. Kind of a small brooch. That is $5. Very good work. On, look at that work on that leaf. Good shape. Great shape. Isn't this one cute? Look at the little doggy. I almost want to keep him. A little poodle doggy. Got some orange bead for eyes. And because I almost want to keep him, you're going to have to give me $5 for him if you want him. $5 for that little poodle. You can name him anything you want to. I don't know if it's picking it up, but there's little rhinestones all over his body right here. The clear rhinestones, none missing. It'll be brooch. Okay, that's five dollars. And then this one is not marked, but I just love it, and I think it's so unique with the little beads and how it's. You see how that's kind of roped in and out. The gold tone is in and out, circular around there. I want five dollars for this. There's the back. Very nice. And then we have this one. And I know it's signed. But I'm going to have to familiarize with myself to remember what it's signed. Because this was one of those that I was first starting out with. And I had to look up the company. It's DCE. See that DCE? And I could I could told you a few months ago what it stood for. But not bought it. So 120th, 14 karat gold filled uh, leaf. What do you call these? They're like the ones the Roman emperors put on their heads. I know what that's called. Oh, uh, like Caesar, you know? You know why he wore that? Because he was bald. He was going bald and he wanted all. He didn't want people to know. So he put it on it and made other people wear theirs. He made them wear their hair like really shaved short because he was going bald. Haha, <laughs> see a little piece of history. Thought I was just... A girl who's selling you some brooches. But I gave you a little piece of history. Laurels. Are they all that? Laurels? Laurel reefs? Is that what they're called? I don't know. Somebody leave me a comment and tell me. But very pretty. Five dollars. This rose. Now I've had a lot of these. But I've had like Avon ones. This is not Avon. This was a new uh, name for me when I got this one. I can't remember what purchase I got this in. And I told you guys I remember at the time on the video. I was, hold on a second. Hang out there and look at the five dollar sign. I was going to have to look it up. And it's Giovanni. It's Giovanni. When I looked it up, it actually they go for quite a bit of money. People have these listed for about 20 bucks. Um, so it's a Giovanni. You can look up that name if you want to know more about the company. Rose. Silver toned. Very nice. $5. So I hope you guys like the brooches. You guys asked for them. Please, like I said, uh, be specific in the ones you want. Some of them are paired up. Let's remember which ones are paired up. These are paired for three. There, maybe over here so you can see. These are paired for three. Uh, what other ones? I'm going to have to, because I want to put them on here so I remember. These are paired for three dollars. Oh, that's far away. You're not going to be able to see. And what else did we, we threw? We put the, where's the carriage? And these two, the ski lift and the carriage were paired up for three. And the rest of them were three on their own. And then over here at the five, we just paired up this one this one because I forgot to put them together. So this one and this one. Remember, this is Monet Monday. 
and then this one. And you get those for five, both together. There's these for five. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you find something you like. And leave me a comment down below and tell me what you want to see next. I have some lapel pins. I think people commented one of those. Um, got some necklaces, but I'll give you the... Oh, I will sell you those touchy yeep. So that's it for right now, guys. Thanks for watching. $3, $5. Thumbs up if you want to give me a thumbs up. Another sales video. Talk to you guys later. Bye.